One technique. After determining up from down visually or with their vestibular apparatus citation needed in the inner ear, cats manage to twist themselves to face downward without ever changing their net angular momentum. They are able to accomplish this with each key steps A and in the middle so that the front half of their body rotates about a different axis than the rear half. We tuck their front legs in to reduce the moment of inertia of the front half of their body and extend their rear legs to increase the moment of inertia of the rear half of their body so that they can rotate their front half quite far as much as 90 while the rear half rotates in the opposite direction quite a bit less as little as 10. See extend their front legs and tuck their rear legs so that they can rotate their rear half quite far while their front half rotates in the opposite direction quite a bit less. Depending on the cat's flexibility and initial angular momentum, if any, the cat may need to repeat steps 2 and 3 one or more times in order to complete a full 180 rotation. 2. Terminal Velocity In addition to the riding reflex, cats have a number of other features that will reduce damage from a fall. Their small size, light bone structure, and thick fur decrease their terminal velocity. Furthermore, once righted they may also spread out their body to increase drag and slow the fall to some extent. A fall and cat's terminal velocity is 100 km slash h 16 miles per hour, whereas that of a falling man in a free fall position is 210 km slash h 130 miles per hour. At terminal velocity they also relax as they fall, which protects them to some extent on impact. Padded paws will also soften impact. Citation needed free injury. Using their riding reflex, cats can often land uninjured. This is, however, far from always the case, and cats can still break bones or die from falls. In a 1987 study, published in the Journal of the American Veterinary Medical Association, of 132 cats that were brought into the New York Animal Medical Center after having fallen from buildings, it was found that the injuries per cat increased depending on the height, fallen up to seven stories but decreased above seven stories. The study authors speculated that after falling five stories the cats reached terminal velocity and thereafter relaxed and spread their bodies to increase drag. However, an alternative interpretation of the study would be that upon an excess of seven stories the cats experience a higher fatality rate which prevents the owner from bringing them in for life-saving treatment.